Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back. So this is what's on this weekend's test server. Alright, Blitz is going to get an additional 15% hit points. And this is just the test server. This could change. This may not be the final results. But it could be. We'll see what happens. Ravana, he's going to have 2 seconds less on the cooldown. So you'll be able to activate his ability 2 seconds quicker each time you want to use it. Plus he's going to get 10% hit points. Al June, okay, ability cooldown increased by 10%, so you're going to have to wait longer in between uses of the ability. And I was wrong here. It's not the amount of time in the air that they're reducing. They're reducing flight acceleration, so he's going to fly 17% slower. All right, he's, fl he's still doing the entire 10 seconds, I guess. He's just moving slower, which would actually explain why it felt like I didn't get my landings correctly because... I was moving a lot slower. So that actually makes sense. Phantom, all right. Ability cooldown increased by 40%. It went from 10 seconds to 14. Avenger, dispersion increased by 10%. So I guess that I don't know if that means the spread is increased by 10% or it's supposed to be shooting 10% faster, one or the other. 15% less damage. So it is definitely getting buffed on the damage. I mean, getting nerfed on the damage. Avalanche, reload time reduced by 20%. Missile speed increased. So I guess it, it, it doesn't reload as slowly and the missiles get to the enemies quicker. All right. Thermite, damage increased by 20%. Missile speed increased. All right, so more damage, and I guess the missiles get to the enemy faster. The SAR reload time reduced by 20%. Pulsar and Shredder changes in mechanics, so it's not really a buff or a nerf. They've changed something. I'm not really, not really sure what it was. I guess that just means maybe it could be the way it looks, or who knows what. But, all right, that's what they were propo proposing for buffs and nerfs on this weekend's test server. All right, thought some of you guys might actually wanna see that, so that's the deal. All right, I knew Al June, I just, I noticed I would always time my landings. I could almost always land exactly where I wanted. And I was having a problem doing that, so I actually thought the flight time was less, but he's just not moving as fast, so I don't, so once you try to get back to your landing spot, you're gonna to have to give yourself more time to get back to your landing since he's moving slower. I'm sure you guys understand what I'm saying, but that's pretty much the deal, all right? Catch you guys later.